Hey folks, I'm Thomas, and welcome back to Stylized Station. And I've always wondered, how are hyper-realistic characters made? In the past few years, there's been some amazing progress. I've always been so There are many ways we can do Right. Um, I've been super impressed by the latest skin. No, no, I can do it. Okay, so that was a weird video that went off the rails a little bit there. Um, you're probably wondering what the fuck was that video about? And you're probably wondering why am I speaking to you right now after a video is over? Because my video style is very notorious for uh, abruptly en abrupt endings. So it's, it's weird for me to speak with you personally, number one, and number two, to um, continue after a video. So it's a little strange, but as we reach the end of the year, um, I thought it would be a good time to sit down and have a quick chat with you guys and explain my thought process and why the video, why that video is the way it is, because that is the last stylized station video of the year. And that is because for the past three, four months, I have been dealing with extreme levels of burnout and I've been able to push through it for a lot of these videos and they've been really great. It's gotten to the point where I can't just push through it anymore. And it's gotten to the point where creatively, uh, I feel like I'm doing psychological damage to myself by continuing to work on these projects. And so that's why this video ended the way it did. Um, I really wanted to create a video on how hyper-realistic humans are made and mess around with metahuman and make some cool shots but I couldn't push through it. I just couldn't do it. So uh, instead I decided to take a creative break and make something that I normally wouldn't and make a bit of a, you know, maybe Westworld inspired, glitchy, ethereal kind of video. And it was super fun to make and I learned a ton. So I'm very excited to put what I've learned into new videos, but it's time to take a break. And with that, I wanted to take a moment to thank you. Um, this has been an incredible year, um, in terms of analytics for stylized station business wise, I have essentially doubled everything, doubled views, uh, doubled subscribers, uh, everything. It's been an incredible year and I really appreciate the support on the new style of videos. Um, like taking really niche game art concepts and breaking down in a very digestible way. I feel like I've found a really, really cool niche that I can tap into and I can run with for a very, very long time and I plan to. And the only reason I can continue to do that is because you guys are watching it. Literally millions of people are watching these videos now, which is insane. Um, and also definitely adds to the pressure, right? YouTube creators, like we put so much pressure on ourselves to make the next video better than the last. And when you create a video that ends up with 1 million views. How do you create a video that's going to do better than that? Right? How do you do it? Um, and I think a lot of that attributes to burnout as well. And I won't talk too much about burnout right now because I'm going to do a video in the new year about it because it's something I think that is very important to talk about. So I won't go too much into it. So let's talk about next year for stylized station. I'm going to be picking videos up probably about mid January. Um, I'll start working on them again so you guys won't get a video until most likely close to February, which is a long time, but I have a certain vision for a stylized station this year and I really 
have a strong intention to execute it at the highest level possible. This channel is one of the biggest channels in the game art niche, if not the biggest channel. And I feel like as a creator and as people who look to this channel for advice and how to grow their skill set and their knowledge, I feel a responsibility to increase the quality of this channel to a, to, to a place where it has never been before. But to do that, um, I need time and I need to sit down and I need to work on my own art skills and my own technical ability so I can continue to create videos that are up to a certain standard that I've set for myself. So with that, I think it's time for me to go for a little bit. I hope everyone has an incredible holiday. I hope everyone gets to see their family um, as minimal arguments as possible. I hope everyone has a great New Year's and I hope you all achieve everything that you want to achieve over the next few months. I truly do. And even if you don't achieve the things you want to achieve, that is also totally okay. You'll get to where you want to be eventually. And in the new year, Stylized Station will be there to help you as well. And I'll be there to help you. So have a great year, guys. I'll see you soon.